the UFC. Dustin Poirier, 31. Dan Hooker is 30 years of age. Hooker, the far taller man, six feet versus five nine. This is the main event of the evening. It's time, Dan, the Hangman Hooker, Dustin, the Diamond Polarian. Instructions, we're going to keep it clean. Touch gloves, let's do it. Oh. Minus 240 favorite, Dustin Poirier. This fight clock is brought to you by Toyo Tires, the official tire of the UFC. Thursday. Hooker with an early land with the left hand. Well, he always circling left. Then when he decides to go right, he throws the cheap kick to the body, which also hides the right knee. So he uses the right leg to hide that right knee. Great left hope found the home. 30. There it is again. He fell that one. That really hurt him. You don't want to take a break. Oh, there it is again. That's two in a row. Look at lives by that motto. Ooh, big hook. And see, that's hook again. Ooh, good connection up top by hook. Left hand. This Every is what time. Poirier's got to do. Now he's on the inside. He's got to double under to work with his own shots in the boxing range. Oh, good kick. And Poirier. Edson Barboza, the only man to beat Dan Hooker on this historic lightweight oh, race. Nice. Big crack from Poirier. Hooker's on the pressure, oh. looking for that knee. Look at that. Inventive. Oh, nice stick and move by Poirier. Oh, now Hooker guys, connects again. This is for landing shots, but the facial expressions. Calm, composed, boom, fired back, landed a good shot. For Hooker, he keeps throwing hooks to the body on Poirier. Poirier's going with that kick. Nice left hand. Yeah, the Great start to a great fight. We're back in 30 seconds. All right, let's take a look at some of the action. There's a nice left hand from Hooker. Poirier eats it well. There's that right hand. On the inside here, a little creativity there from Dustin Poirier. I like that. The exchange blows right there. And look at the variety as well. That Hooker's throwing. Oh, I mean, those yeah. are big shots. Oh! So creative, you know? He's like, okay, all right, I can't get the takedown, but I see your face and I have a hand for it. Watch the knee. Watch the clinch. Oh, oh, wow! Yeah. Huge elbow as part of that yeah. exchange. Look at this. Here comes Man. the knee soon. Oh, wow! Oh, wow. The wow. wow! I mean, come on. See if they stay in the pocket here. Oh, oh. It looked like he was too far away from the knee. To inside and brawl, and you know, technically brawl, that's when he's having success. And what I love him up. Ooh, good one two by Hooker there. Both guys landing power shots, 68%. Oh, I mean, both guys are exhausted already, and I'm not. <laughs> nice lead elbow there, wearing it, but staying tough. I mean, both these. It's and awesome. talk, and Poirier just Ooh. acknowledged that jab from Hooker. Fire on each other, it's awesome. Dustin is definitely trying to take his head off. Getting in with the pressure. Whoa, oh, nice, that knee. nice left hand by Hooker there. Dustin's got to be careful. He can't get too overconfident. When the momentum shifts his way, he gets a little reckless, and he's got to be careful. Nice. Oh, so oh, You know what? You hit me, I'll hit you. You hit me, I'll hit you. And let's just let the world see it, because this is amazing to watch, the toughness of these gentlemen. So it seems as though we did not overstate the potential of this lightweight main event. Yeah, I mean, come on, this is... I mean, huge slugfest here, but look at the exchanges here. Nice body shots to an uppercut, and he just keeps ripping uppercuts, body shots, uppercuts, body shots. It's so fun to watch. And then you see Poirier with a counter left hook. I mean, these guys just say... <laughs> And somebody's gonna fall. Yeah, somebody's getting out of here. That's how both of these guys are fighting to finish. Beautifully done to the body by Paul. Nice counter hook. Paul Felder in his first UFC main event back in February. Oh. Eats a right. Yeah, first two rounds for sure. But they're looking like that. Oh. 
I mean, the accuracy of Poirier, he always lands in these shots. He doesn't miss very often. When he fires, he lands. I guarantee they'll do it a little slower. Right. And you saw that you've got just engage, you're gonna fight Khabib. And then at the top, you know, oh, I mean, this, that. that's in there. This is one to have this, guys. That is so. No! Fuckers out! Beautiful jump. Corey has got that overhook on the left side. My knee come under the elbow. Here. Sitting here waiting. He's trying to create something from the bottom, Poirier. No, he's being very aggressive from his back. He's trying to set up a lot of submissions here. But I always say two, three. So Dustin just said, what's the time? Taking advantage of the fact there's no crowd. And now he's trying some space to stand now he's up. Get up. He's got to watch his back. Nice job by Poirier to use that. He's talked about using a submission attempt to get to your feet. Oh, those landed hard. I mean, they're just eating everything. Look at their faces. 15 minutes in the kick. The double leg, of course, Dustin goes for the, the same guillotine he tried on Habib. And then he threw up a variety of submissions. Eventually got back to the feet. And then they went right back to doing what they did the entire... All right, another insanely action-packed round. There's a good jab from Dustin. Left hand finds the mark. And it was just like this from start to finish, to be honest. But here's Dan Hooker surprises him with... Beautiful job. We have Poirier, Poirier, keeping the pressure going. Nice takedown down by Hooker there. That was a yeah. good decision there. Very good decision, but wisely done by Poirier on this occasion. Got straight back. We see Poirier, two hands on the canvas. Goes for a switch here. Well, I think the game plan for Hooker is very evident here. And, and now he's going back to try to even the score on those takedowns. And not much resistance there from Hooker. Head higher. There it is. And Hooker here. If he keeps he's going to keep his back. He'll keep control. Boy, uh, Hooker's going to give us coming up here, guys, because Poirier is an expert in this position. He has the grappling advantage. Hooker's got to get that there. He's got to twist that thumb down. He's still got it. Still got it. He's trying to step in. Hooker's going to step. Yep. To sit up more, if you will, and then he can take his right arm and put it over the back of Hooker. Brown, this is what high-level mixed martial arts is all about. Break that grip. Break that grip. Break that grip. We'll see him go. Oh, he's going again. For it again. And now it's like, now he's got the full guard. Seconds left is not a bad idea. Yeah. Four minutes left, three minutes left, I'd say no. But 20 seconds, hey, go for it. You might just get it. All right, that's for Hooker. Hooker's using a lot of strategies in this set, in this last fourth round, and now you see Poirier. He's got to keep that thumb locked in there, but it's because he doesn't, Hooker's able to switch that up, twist his hand. Yeah, we see here the jab lands, and then he keeps following it up. Another jab. Nice body kick by Hooker here, and another body kick timed into a takedown. On these significant strikes thus far. Whatsoever. Nice left. Second round for Hooker, and then two big rounds for Poirier. There's that Poirier jab on point again from Dan Hooker. Oh! Yeah, that one hurt. Nicely defended. Final two and a half minutes. Oh! Double left hand time. He needs to defend. Oh, he does Big it. late takedown for Hooker, his fourth of the fight. Pulse on the right hand side and try and suck his legs out and get back to his feet, which is exactly what he did. Try and not give up. And look at that, so nice. I mean, that is a lot of skill. Oh, good connection by Poirier. Hooker in He's on a take down. Switch up to a single. Hop on, man. Switch up to a single. Yeah, yeah just. Knee, hook, knee. Oh, nice cheer from Dan. That bridge, nice. Chucks it off and fires back. Really great an opportunity. Poirier is just trying to pour it on right now. And Poirier finishing this fight yeah. very, very strong. I mean, these guys stand up in a pause on what that a fight. one. Oh I think God. I speak for... Start putting the damage on. And round five, Poirier came... Sorry, Hooker came out looking for the takedown. And Dustin did a good job of being disciplined and not jumping to his back and looking for the... You're going to smash my face? You're going to fight Gacy Nights? You're going to fight me? Hey. Okay. Hey, you're on the right track. Keep working, all right? Hey, look, look at this. Yeah. Working, all right? <laughs> They're ready for a round six. For the winner, by your name!
Mr. Decision, Dustin the Diamond.